from News 5. Here's your top stories in Power of 5 weather. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital. It was a little chilly this morning, but by the afternoon, sunshine, temperatures in the low to mid 70s, and I think we stay dry until late tonight as a cold front arrives. We could see some showers after 10 o'clock, otherwise sunny today, climbing up to around 72 at 3, near 74 by about 4 o'clock this afternoon. Cold front comes in after 10, may squeeze out a couple of showers. It knocks our temperatures down for the weekend, just 63 on Saturday, but a warm front brings us back to 73 on Sunday. All right, Jenny. Well, Nick and Mona here in the News 5 studio with a look at today's top stories. Overnight, a fire tearing through the Chardon Square Collision Center. The damage to the business is extensive. A Chardon police officer spotted the smoke around 10 last night. 13 fire departments responded, but they couldn't go inside. The roof was ready to collapse. Thankfully, no one was hurt. The cause still under investigation. And right now, Summa Health is looking for a partner. The health system is looking to provide long-term financial stability and advance the services it offers to patients in the Akron area. Last year, Summa lost its emergency residency education accreditation and its CEO. And there will be extra security on the campus of Kent State tomorrow for an open carry gun walk. At the same time, a student group plans to hold a memorial service for gun victims. The university library, student center, and bookstore will all be closed. And you can check back later today for another update and download the News 5 app for breaking news and alerts. Sponsored by Akron Children's Hospital.